Hey guys, it's Jonathan from Bullet Motorsports. Today I'm gonna to show you a beautiful 1955 Ford Fairlane. This is a comprehensive restoration. I just drove it on the highway with zero issues. We took it on the turnpike. I was going 60, 65 miles an hour. No overheating problems. It's powered by a V8 with tri-power. It's a three on the tree. If you wanna find out full information on this ride, just click on the link below. It's gonna show you if we're gonna sell it at auction, if we're gonna retail it. It also is going to offer you financing and transport options. So we're here to help you decide on buying this car. The next step of this video is gonna be us doing a complete walk around and then we're gonna jump in and take it for a test drive. Thank you and please subscribe. Overall condition, I'd rate this easily an eight and a half out of 10. Paint is extremely nice. All the bright work in chrome, that's show quality chrome right there. Uh, the only imperfection I really can see on this car, the trim on the front nose is starting to come off. So the tabs in the back are not in place. So there's a little bit of tape here from the prior owner. Engine, so it's a V8 with tri-power. I don't know if it's a 292 or a 312, but based on how it feels, it's probably a 312. So basically like a Ford Thunderbird motor. It does not have power brakes, but the brakes feel great. They're even throughout. All the wiring is upgraded. Radiator's been recorded. Uh, battery's new, and we just went through it. So we put on the lift, we made sure that the brakes were good. Um, also, we had a complete tune-up. Brad, or Bruce from Brad's Automotive, rebuilt all three carburetors. We redid the ignition, uh, coil, and now this thing hums down the road. It starts up on the first click, which is great. This tri-power setup sounds unbelievable when you start to get onto 75% throttle. You can hear them open up and it really does add that additional fuel you need to get some more power. Closing the hood right now. Closes nicely. Your bird is very clean and all the bright work throughout is extremely nice. You can see that the paint is even throughout and the reflection is, is well, you can't really see that much reflection, but the, there's no uneven spots or blotchiness. The wheels match the actual paint. I love the Coker white walls because it matches that top section right here. Doors are extremely detailed. So you can see they did not paint the hardware. All of your door cards are very nice. The interior is very nice. Your door cards match the interior seats. Carpet has been steamed, but there still is a little bit of staining on the, on the carpet right there. All of your rubber is good, and underneath this car looks the same as the top of the car. So the, you can actually see the blue on the floor pans. Your dash is very clean as well. Uh, the tubes for the radio actually turn on, and the speedometer works perfectly. Doesn't overheat at all. Horn works. You do have a set of seatbelts front and rear. So this is a four-door sedan, which is great because if you have kids and you want to go to car shows, you throw them back there. If you have grandkids, you can throw them back there. The door card's extremely nice right here. All your windows go up and down with ease. And as I said, I just drove this on the highway. It was, it was 15 miles there, 15 miles back. No issues with overheating and it cruises down the road. I felt safe in it. The brakes felt good. Uh, interior seats back here, very nice. The headliner is nice as well. Let me grab the keys and I'll open up the trunk for you. There's a ton of documentation back there and we'll also showcase it in the photo gallery. So we're at the rear of the car. You can see that the bright work in chrome is extremely nice. I do see a little bit of pitting right here, but overall is very clean. Open up the trunk right now. Oh, I took that corner sharp. So here's all the paperwork that we're gonna include. There's a lot of manuals, um, some of the circuitry for your, your, if you had power windows, power seats, and then the whole entire circuit setup for all the electronics, which is really neat. So if you ever need to follow it and the color combinations are proper for what's underneath the hood. I do, I do have some additional towels from car shows. We have a jack and a spare tire. And when you pull this mat up, look at how nice that is. I don't think I've ever seen a four door this, this detailed up. The trunk is extremely clean. That's all metal. Passenger side is the same as the driver's side. And when you open up these doors and close them, look how nice it is. It closes perfectly. Roof line is very nice. There's no dents or dings. 
a little imperfection right here on this bright work piece. Seat belts in the rear, as I said, and those tires are in great shape. I didn't have any humming or, or weird noises at speed. Windows go down nicely. And the best part, that e-brake's on right now. So if I get in here, make sure it's in neutral. Starts right up. So it's running off the center carb right now, and then when you start to actually give it throttle, and go over, I think, 65 to 75% throttle, it'll open up those, those other two carburetors, and it gives you a really whimsical sound. Interior is really clean, and we'll go for that. We'll go over that as we go for the test drive. Let's jump in it and go for a ride. Whimsical. We'll go through the gears right now. Clutch is nice and easy. Second. Take a sweeping corner here. Brakes are even. Oh, this car is awesome. Big steering wheel, so it's easy to steer. It's like a tennis ball, dude. Well, the tennis ball is in case you get lost in the parking lot you know which car is yours in case there's another 1955 Fairlane <laughs> at the store. We're in second right now. And watch, you'll hear the secondaries if you hear them open up. It's smooth, smooth as butter. Close this so you guys can have a better sound. We're going uh, 55 miles an hour right now with no issues at all. Just a good runner. We're gonna turn left here. Brakes are even. You can downshift it easily. I did do a heel toe on this. <laughs> but it's a turnkey. So if you guys are looking for something that you can enjoy with your family, this is it. Turn signal's working, fuel gauge is working. Our temperature gauge is working. Let's see if our blower motor works. So blower, blower motor does not work. We're gonna go over some bumps here. Here's a big divot. <laughs> it's like you're flying. <laughs> Feels good. We're gonna get some uh, exterior shots right now. If you guys have any questions about this ride or any of the inventory we have, you can click on the link below. That's gonna bring you to our website so you can see that it's, if it's still available or if it's headed to auction. And if you have any further questions from there, just give us a call at 954-363-2261. We offer financing with three great lenders. We can offer transport. Uh, and when we do transport, we're using a secondary source and we pass that savings on to you. So whatever my cost is for transport is what you're gonna get. It actually has some boogie, I want you to know that. This actually drives awesome. So I was really impressed yesterday driving into the, we had to get it inspected. This car is from Canada. So first gear is down, second gear is up, third gear is all the way down. Reverse is straight up. We're gonna go forward. I'm pulling the emergency brake off right now. All your lights work. Clock does not operate. Shifting is easy, so it's not, all over the place, a lot of column shifts. I've been in in the past, they had like a, like there's like a lag to it. You can actually shift this quickly and you're not gonna have any binding. We're in second still, we'll let it pull through.
Have a good day. Area code 954.